Telecom Malaysia Berhad or TM is collaborating with hotel operator Accor to provide its latest ICT and entertainment package to hotels. The package comprises in-building broadband solutions and TM's own IPTV services, including HIP TV and a call center service. All these will be powered by TM's high-speed broadband network connectivity. At the collaboration signing ceremony, TM Executive Vice President Azizi Hadi said TM and Accor will also be partners in the form of loyalty programs, marketing strategies and promotions. However, he declined to reveal the expected profits from the venture, nor disclose the amount of investment put into the partnership. Uh, in terms of uh, monetary benefit, uh, I, I don't think I want to uh, share it with you. Uh, it's, it's a bit premature at the moment. Uh, I mean, we, we do have a business case when we develop uh, this concept and so on, uh, but we, we need to see first on how the uh, take up and so on, and uh, probably at a later stage we will share. Uh, probably uh, for TM, probably when we uh, do our uh, year end closing. Azizi added that TM has already tied up with more than 40 hotels for similar deals and aims to rope in a total of 150 hotels by the end of this year. Accor Hotels, which is based in France, operates over 3,600 hotels in 92 countries. Here in Malaysia, it operates nine hotels including Pullman Hotel, Novotel and Ibis Hotel. The group primarily operates corporate hotels targeting business travellers. Thus, it stresses on the importance of internet connectivity. Yes, but we should not look at number of hotels only, but we should look at number of customers. Because I believe uh, today we have probably around 2,000 customers a day coming, staying in our hotels. And this is the, the target for, uh, for uh, Telecom Malaysia, because they will be using also the, the internet service, as I mentioned. Wi-Fi connection is very important and we cannot fail on that and we need a very reliable partner. Gilouet said the group targets to increase its presence in Malaysia to 20 hotels by 2016. Jacqueline Peng, DHTV.